padlock. The padlock is a function that allows you to lock certain parts of an app so that users cannot access it unless they're logged in. That helps you quite a bit if you want to track who's using your app and what they're doing with the app. So on padlock, there's a couple of options. Once again, we can change our icon, like with most of the rest. We can change the names, so we can call it members only if we like. And this is where we set the padlock function. So you can unlock it in two different ways. The one is a QR code. So in other words, the user can unlock his padlock or his members area by scanning a QR code. Or you can just use the accounts function where the user can put in a username and password or log in with Facebook and in that way unlock his padlock or members area. Allow all users by default. No, we'll leave it like that. Lock the entire application. Now this option allows you to either lock your entire app, so the user cannot access anything until he's logged in, or if you set it to no, it will allow you to lock certain features. So let's set it to no. If you can see, I've put a couple of features in here, discount, calendar, and booking. And over here, we have the ability to pick which ones we will be locking. So we can lock booking and calendar and leave discount open. Or I suppose we can leave lock calendar and discount and leave booking open. Well, anyway, and there we go. We've created our padlock. So our padlock is officially saved. And when you look at it over here, you will see that there's a members area and you are not able to access the members area unless you are logged in. And that's your padlock feature. Cheers.